everyone, it's Jezzy, and today we are taking a cafe and making it ready for St. Patrick's Day. So we're going to use a lot of green and a lot of CC. This is actually a custom build here available for download at TSR. It is by Danta720, and it is called the Romantic Cafe, which I will link in the links below. I'm going to try to fit all the links that I used for the CC here, but... YouTube does have its limits, so we will get as much as we can. A lot of this was just recoloring to, it was honestly perfect how it was because it's a really pretty lot and great for pictures, but just for the holiday, I'm coloring it. It's really cute and actually has two separate buildings. It's got the cafe and then the nectar cafe as well. So. It's, I think, a really usable lot. It was perfect for San Machino, but you could also put it in other worlds as well. It would fit a lot of, like any older area, or if you wanted to make like a newer area look a bit older, because it is in an older, like classical vintage build style, which I absolutely adore. It's perfect for a coffee shop. It's it's a smaller space, but the inside of it is very open, so Sims can move around quite well. And it even has an upstairs where there is a reception center. So if you wanted to, you know, do like a wedding reception, you could. It also has some really green areas in the front and on the sides with a lot of plants, a lot of water structures. And it just gives it this very romantic and springy feel. Like, it's, it's absolutely gorgeous. So we're going to speed up and get to the end. And hopefully I won't break the lot, right? That's, that's the goal right now. Is because it's awesome as is. So we're just going to try to preserve that, right? So here we are at the finished product. It is very green. I might have went overboard. I tried to keep it somewhat minimal on the walls. I wanted things on the walls, but I really like this wallpaper. It seems to really fit the style of build it is. And I mean, really a lot of the things I just turned from like a white wood to a darker wood just to match the green better. So a lot of it was honestly just recoloring swatches because everything's placed so perfectly. So that made my job a lot easier. So then we just did like a little backdrop here to the coffee shop. I added coffee cups, a menu, 
and then some hanging plants of course there are like so many plants in here and I tried to find something for the tables that looked like little shamrocks but you know it it, it works it looks adorable because you know, St. Patrick's Day and shamrocks so yes it is functional still I did not mess it up and it looks absolutely pretty I love it it's I could have probably added more plants or stuff on the walls, but again, I like this wallpaper and I kind of like every, like in that regard for things to be minimalistic. I adore the upstairs, the hanging plants around the like drinking fountain thing or how it's a fountain, but you know, the punch bowl, like I love that. Those are great. And with those curtains, it just looks amazing. And then on the table, there's like shamrock. They, I don't know if they're actual shamrocks. They kind of look like shamrocks and then the little green hearts. So it is perfect for like a wedding reception. Outside, I love the shape of this lot. Again, it was just like simple switching for green elements. And I forgot one of the little awning things, but that's okay. It's fine. It honestly looks better black and white, but because St. Patrick's Day is green. I changed it to green. But like the shape of this building is, it's very nice and it fits the style of build so well. Like it looks like an older cafe, like, or like an older styled home. And it just, it's, it's great. I love it. The windows fit, everything fits wonderfully. The barista has blue eyebrows with white hair. I mean, you do you, but I don't think it matches. So yeah, this is, it's definitely functional. I had quite a bit of people in here, so it is tested and it works. And I will, I will link as much as I can fit in the description below. And of course the lot being the first link because the slot is amazing. So if you're looking for a community lot, I highly recommend this one and you don't even have to do anything to it like it's it's great if you like this video please like and subscribe and if you're celebrating happy st. Patrick's Day